settling on blue water, traveling across a picturesque dreamland. There are ancient houses with black bricks and white walls. It feels like walking in a painting. A beautiful night that dates back thousands of years. Watch out for fires when the weather is dry. It felt as if the carving knife weighed a thousand kilos. How long does it take to finish your wood carving? They are fantastic craftsmen. Welcome to Shidi. Shidi Village is located south of the Yangtze River with distinct white walls and black tiles. I can't wait to see the place I've always imagined. We made it! Wow, what a gorgeous memorial archway. When was this built exactly? During the Ming Dynasty. Appointed by Emperor Jiajing? Yes, it is different from other memorial archways in the Huizhou region. Oh. It was built for an honest and upstanding official. The emperor oh. built it in his honor. He was not high ranking, but had a good reputation. Oh. When he retired and returned to his hometown, the emperor had a memorial archway built for him. This is remarkable. This is an impressive an emblem honor. of stone carving. Isn't this the essence of stone carving? Yes, absolutely. It's one of three famous carvings in the Huizhou region. Look how delicately it's carved. Definitely. Black bricks and white walls. Yes. yes. There are ancient houses everywhere. They are very well preserved. It's so lovely. Mm. It feels like walking in a painting. Mm. Yes. It is as precious as the Forbidden City and the Great Wall in Beijing. Oh. For a small village, yeah. there's something really special yes. about it. She's washing clothes. Look yes. over there. I just wonder how she got down there. Aren't oh, there, there steps? Yes, huh? the step is over the there. The steps are so interesting. They look oh, peculiar. Like hanging steps. Yes, watch your steps. Watch your steps. Slippery. Miss Zhang will be fine since she's Just athletic, be strong, and agile. Miss Meng, well, are you coming down, down too? It's Let me awesome. Join you. It's oh, cool to ride the water. Now. It is spring water. Yes. Oh yes, my. Yes, it flows straight from the mountain. We usually wash clothes, vegetables, and dishes here. You have a washing machine now. Why don't you use it? Why not wash your clothes at home? Well, you see, that's because the mountain spring water is always clean and cool. And the older generations have frugal habits. Even though they have washing machines, oh. they still like mm. to do the washing by the stream. Oh. oh. Yes. Well, I want to give it a go. Come on. Here Come we on. go. Miss Zhang, yes, you're an yes. expert. <laughs> yeah, she is. You must be really good at housework. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh my, boy. this makes me want to go back to my own little village. Yeah, I, I also feel To be homesick. honest, my goodness. To be honest, I felt homesick when I <laughs> saw the stream. It's nostalgic. <laughs> yes, I lived in the countryside before. Oh. I remember washing clothes in the summer. The villages in North oh. China have streams and people there wash this way. Yes, exactly. Hello. Nice to Hello, meet you. Hello, nice to see you all. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Hello man. Welcome. Yes, Welcome. thank you. Nice to see you. Hello. So nice to see you. Hey there, little boy. Hello. Hello. What a welcome. big family you have. Hello. 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 Nice Hello. to meet you. Hello. 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 <laughs> this is where the three of us will Hello. stay today. Yes. Nice to meet That's you. Right. Yes. Ah, Mr. Mm. Lu, your room is here. Well, I'm yes, over there. This way. <laughs> it's so spacious. Yeah, there wow. Are. There's two floors. Just like a loft in the city. That's amazing. <laughs> My goodness, this room is great. I love it, I love it. Wow. I'll take the upstairs room. Okay. It'll be like going back to college. Yes, we will be sleeping <laughs> on bunk beds. Look at the furnishings. A bottle, a, a mirror, bottle. and a clock. And a mirror. It means lifelong peace. Yes. Oh, lifelong peace. It it's is. It's really auspicious. Since local people start work around the age of 13 Children or 14, are sent out at 13 and they or no longer stay at home. <laughs> Family members need this type of shrine mm, to pray oh. for lifelong peace. This is our joyous reunion table. Here it is. It's half a, a table. half moon. See? This is a reunion? Well, ah. okay. <laughs> Perfect. Come sit. I will. <laughs> <laughs> it's great to chat like this. Have some sliced watermelon. Ah. Have oh. a taste. Thank you. Here you go. Oh, Someone thank you. Hi. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Try our thank sweets, you. please. Did you make this at home or this buy This is it? part of our cultural heritage, mm. a local mm. speciality. So what's inside it? Yes. Mmm. Mmm. 
We call it top crisp, also known as black sesame crisp. When making it, it's pressed layer by layer with black sesame seeds and flour. Why is it called top crisp? Because when Emperor Chang Long went south of the Yangtze River, he had a sweet wrapped in red paper. He said it was the best confectionery he'd eaten on the market. Really? That's where it got its popular name. Ah, Emperor Qianlong couldn't have been here. It's just a legend, but we have been using the name ever since. Yes. During the Hai Qing era, there was a prosperous time for Hui Zhou merchants. Anwei people are smart. What's the most important is that they're both studious and able to endure hardships. Yeah. They've been apprentices since the age of 13 and 14. It's the way of life. Hui Zhou is three types of carvings, right? Exactly. Stone, brick, and wood carving. We saw the stone carving at the village entrance. Yes, the memorial archway. Wood carving can be seen everywhere in the house. They're all wood carvings. What's carved up there? The overall shape of this wood carving is in Chinese character of commerce. Ah. It's our central tenet as merchants. The top is shaped like a point stroke, right? Yes, you're right. The highest stroke in the character of commerce. It means a person passing by. Ah, yes, yes, I got it. As a whole, it's for the Chinese character of commerce. Ah, this is so interesting. We have a craftsman. Let's go to meet him then. His name is Mr. Wang. We want to see the wood carving process. Let's go for a look. Let's go look at the wood carving and see how it's carved. Sure, let's go. Let's go. Mo Shang Villa. Mo Shang Villa. Let's have a look inside. Come on. Hello, welcome. Good to see you, Mr. Wong. Hello, welcome. I'm glad to see welcome you. Welcome to you all. Hello, Mr. Wong. Yes, hello. Master. Hello, glad hello, to see Mr. you. Hello, Mr. Wong. Master Wong, we've come ah. to look at the carving process. Want to look? Sure. Ah. Huh. What are you carving? Well, it's our idyllic home with mountains and rivers. Mm. Wow. It's just like this. Splendid, an idyllic home with mountains and rivers. Wood carving of the Hoizhou region is a national and tangible cultural oh. heritage. It's a traditional handcraft. Mm. The whole piece of work is carved with a technique of deep yes, relief. Yes, it's deep relief. Many parts in the middle are hollowed out. So that's why it looks very three-dimensional. How long did it take you to carve this one? This piece of work took me several yeah, years years. altogether. That long? Of course, it's this so yes. complicated so as you Look can Look at see. the expression mm. on this figure. It's so vivid. Yes. yes. This child is setting off firecrackers and the one next to him is covering yes. his ears. It's marvelous. Yes, it is. I have been doing this since uh, the age of 16. Do you have apprentices? Yes. For example, we set up studios mm. in the colleges. Colleges? Ah. And we teach college students to pass on this cultural oh. heritage. Can you teach us? <laughs> sure. <laughs> Do you accept older students, perhaps? Uh, yes. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> really? Let's go over there. If we carve something like this, <laughs> it'll it be a could tragedy. Look awful. I agree. Let's find some rotted wood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Although rotted wood cannot be carved, it would definitely suit us. Distinguished guests, I'll assign a task to each of you. Ah. One is to carve auspicious clouds. The other is to carve dragon scales, and lastly, to carve this ribbon. I'll do the auspicious okay, cloud. I'm not sure this one. Then I'll carve dragon scales. This part? I'll take whichever is the, the easiest. The ribbon is the easiest. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. I'll start. Let's do it. Uh -huh. When you're carving, don't do it this way. It doesn't yeah. work like that. Uh -huh. You need to control the knife with your hands to lead the direction of the arc. Just huh. trim it gently huh. to keep it smooth. Okay. Use the strength from your mm. wrist rather than your arm. Okay. okay, my task is to do the yes, dragon scale. This is the part I'll right need a here. chisel. Now, mm -hmm. look, there is a roundness to the I dragon see. scales. Do you see what I mean? Yes, I see. They intersect here I see it now. in a semicircle. Now it's your turn. I'll try. Go ahead, take it slow. Hmm. What should I do? I'll demonstrate. Mm -hmm. Use this knife to make the outside higher and the inside lower, oh. okay? Ah, let me try. Sure, let me try. take it slow. Mm -hmm. Don't carve too deep. Yeah. If it's too deep, there's no going back. But this knife doesn't move at all. This job is not easy. Not easy. My carvings already made the dragon angry. <laughs> I think your task looks quite easy. What? Don't you just need to tap it a couple of times? Careful. 
Oh, I really admire the craftsmen. They do this one bit at a time until it's finished. Hmm. That's why it takes years to finish one piece of carving. Oh, it's incredible. They are fantastic craftsmen. That's the spirit of craftsmanship. Uh -huh. Two taps are enough. Don't oh, go I too see. deep. I'll do, do it, it this way. way. Yes, that's right. When I picked up the carving knife, I didn't even think about my carving skills. It felt as if the carving knife weighed a thousand kilos. I couldn't even move it at all. The spirit of craftsmanship is so precious in China. The skills are truly passed on by an oral tradition, which are accumulated and inherited bit by bit. <laughs> Although I'm a layman, I can see that it's ruined. Sorry, Mr. Wang. Oh. This work has been ruined. <laughs> ruined? I don't think so. Is when you ruined? use the chisel, look, <laughs> rather really? move it this way. It'll take Mr. Wong half a year to repair it. <laughs> repair it? <laughs> <laughs> look, cut it like <gasps> this. Do you see? Luckily, there's still the chance fixed. to fix it. It's not so bad. I'm sorry, as long Mr. As it can Wong. Be fixed, it's fine. It isn't easy to handle the carving knife. Mr. Wong is very dexterous, doing it with ease and skill, but we are so clumsy. That's why it's a specialized skill. Wood carvings in the Huizhou style can be found in many of the homestays in our village. Mm. If you have spare time, you should go and have a look. All Thank right. you. Yes, After your explanation, right. we can also see some clues. Yes. I'm glad you <laughs> learned you're something. you're a quick learner. <laughs> Everything in the Huizhou region makes people feel calm, as if surrounded by green mountains and clear water. Ah, I see they've these grown are called hair. hairy Look tofu, there. yes. Oh my goodness, no! It doesn't smell good at all. Yes, this is the first strange thing about Huizhou. I've never sliced this before. I'm worried you'll cut your fingers. <laughs> okay. It's obvious you don't chop things at home. I can do it. Really? Mm. Let me okay, show you. Okay, fine. You can have a go. I'll try. Ah. I thought you were going to cut yourself. Now you think I will. It seems like you're good at this. Not bad, right? Great, you're doing a good job. I didn't expect this. Wow. Really? That's enough. Enough? Absolutely enough. Don't be silly. No, 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 one no more. more. It's too much for us. No. Just don't waste. More. Just ah. one more. We've got so many people eating together. It'll be a lot when this is cooked. It won't. I hope so. Sharp knife Jung suits you. <laughs> <laughs> Local hairy tofu smells bad, but it always tastes really good. Are there three stinky foods? The ones right in front of us. Three local stinky foods? We have three stinky foods. Ah, hairy tofu, stinky tofu, and stinky yes, mandarin yes, fish? Yes. Another dish. Ah, scrumptious. Dinner time, come on. What a feast. So many dishes. Just look at this. One, two, three, four. Wow, we've got 10 dishes now. 10 is perfect in Chinese food culture, yes. 
Welcome, everyone. Thank you, ladies. Thank you for your Thank hospitality. You. Thank you yes, for your delicious food. Yes, thank you. Thank you, kind you of so you. much. To a happy life. Cheers. Cheers. We love fragrant wine accompanied while, while singing. singing. What kind of tofu is this? It's hairy That's tofu. That's hairy tofu. It tastes a little like homestyle fermented tofu. Oh, it does. Delicious. I get that. Delicious. Mmm. Mm. Mmm. Ah, I'm not being flattering. But really? this is delicious. I'm glad. Amazing. That's right. Mmm. Try this one. Mr. Lu, let's get the night watch together. Let's go. Okay. Do you know why we need to do this? Our houses are quite tall yes. and made of wood. That is right. If there's a fire, it can be very serious. Yes. A patrol team was adopted during the Ming and Qing dynasties. Ah. It lasted to this day and ensures our safety. Let's do it. So loud. Watch out for fires when the weather is dry. It's loud. It's very loud. Yes. <laughs> the whole village will hear it. Watch out for fires when the weather is dry. So yes, the members are Are volunteers. all of them young villagers? Young people, and also retirees. There are retirees. There are workers, ah. farmers, hmm. and cleaners. The youngest is 21 years old. Watch out for fires when the weather is dry. Very good. <laughs> wow, walking this way twice a day takes time. I can imagine it can get very boring for the team members. Well, it is always. Ah. It can be rainy and snowy too. It's very slippery. Slates like this can ah. be very slippery. They have traditions of inclusiveness and courtesy. The love they have for their hometown is evident, that's for sure. Everyone accepts and inherits all the customs so that they're passed on successfully. our two ladies to get up so early. The dishes are exquisite. The breakfast is abundant. Yes. Let's start. Ah. Come. Yes, let's Come start quiet. eating. I want another egg. Yes, help yourself <laughs> tomorrow. Mr. Lu, we have an old house to be repaired today. Okay. Mr. Lu, we need your help. Oh, sure. You're a strong man, <laughs> right? Ah. You can help us change a beam. You have to eat more. We have to install the beam. You can take it off our shoulders once it's been picked up. Oh, no, but I have weak shoulders. You can have another egg. Then I have to eat another egg. Yes, eat more. Beam installation is a big deal. Such a glorious mission entrusted to you. You're right. Come on, eat some more. Well, let me have another yes, egg. have some more. Ah. Don't be shy. Have more, have more. Eating. We'll build your strength. What do the ladies do when we put up the beam? Will they cook? In our village, they don't carry things. They do housework. But we don't just want to serve tea and water all the time. We can do other things. Provide logistic service. Because they ate as much breakfast as I did. <laughs> <laughs> they can dry crops. Dry crops? Here we dry chilies, corn cobs, and similar things. We do this in the autumn. Let's go then. Let's go. Wow. Huh. They're waiting. It's wrapped <laughs> up in a red cloth. <laughs> stand there. Please tell me where in to stand. The middle. Okay. Ah, got it. I okay, place it on my right shoulder like this. Right. No, we're hitting this it's way. like this. Huh? Just like this. Oh, okay. I got it. Yes, ah. then, let's get working. <clears throat> I got it. It's a good beam. All right, ready, everybody? Great. Let's go. 
start. Let's go. Here we go. Okay. We're gonna get it done. Come on, guys. Let's work okay. together. Go. That's Productive it. Productive hour. Rise. 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 Wow. Let's move. Yes. Move. No matter how heavy it is, it can be transported as long as we carry it in unison. Ah, yes. Good job. I believe doing something together can make you happy. It's difficult to move. Yes. We will go boating and start sailing too. The waves search at the sound of the horn. Numerous boats compete with each other, leaving the waves behind and heading for shore. Come on, guys, we're almost there. Everyone works together to sail. Let's take it into the house. <laughs> this thing is very get inside heavy. The house. Let's get inside. Let's go. Let's go. Get inside. Yes, this way. Come on, guys, let's move. Carrying this looks easy, but it is hard when you really try it. Only when it's on your shoulders can you feel its weight. We're almost there. Here we are. Turn here. Ooh, slow down. Slow Come down. Come on. Watch your step. Uh, we need Let's go. Slow down. Take it slow. Slowly. All right. Turn here. Yes, one by one. Slow down okay. a bit. Okay. Go this way. Those at the back. Come. Okay. We're we're turning now. You should move forward. Okay. Again. I'll move forward. Okay. That's a bit good. more. Careful. All right. All right. Here we go. Almost there. That's good. Mr. Lou, let's go. They will still carry it. Okay, but we need to go in. Yes, you're right. Okay, I got it. I'll go in. Can you make it? Hold this and Do go Do I need in. to go in? You can let it go. It'll be okay. Go in. Okay, Slow that's all down. right. The doorway's wide. The doorway's wide. This We're way. We're almost there. This, this doorway way. is wide enough. Uh, how are we uh, supposed to fit this through? Keep it steady. Come on, this way. Good, good. Keep going. Right. Keep Ugh. going. Right. That's it. Good. Forward. Good, good, Forward. good. Just keep yeah. going. This way. All right. Right. Hey. Okay. Yeah. We're almost yeah, there. That's good. One, two, three. Well, well done. done, boys. Careful. Careful. Oh, got this. Almost there. Oh, okay. Keep it okay. steady. Okay. Drop it down. Yeah. Slowly. 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 All right. What? One, One two, two, three. Okay. Well there you go. Yeah. Yes. To maintain unity and harmony among villagers is important. The best way is to do things together. The maintenance of relationships in a village relies on these daily things. One, two, three, go. Rise. One, two, three. Rise. One, two, two three. three. Rise. One, two, 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 three. One, one, two, two, three. Rise. One, one, two, two, three. One, two, two, three. Two, three. One, two, 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 three. three. One, two, two, three. One, two, two, three. three. Okay. <sighs> there we go. <clears throat> there you go. Good job. Ha <laughs> ha. I think he's got this one under control. He's so good. It's been installed. Ah. Oh. Is it in? Is it in? It's in place. Success. Okay, it's in, it's in place. place. Great success. It is very important to sustain some ancient buildings in the village. Keep good lifestyles and maintain the harmony of the people. These are all important aspects of our current society.